In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to differentiate sec x. Now we're going to be using the quotient rule, and I've written that over on the right hand side just as a little reminder. Now sec x, we can actually write as 1 over cos x. So we get d over dx of 1 over cos x. So now when we compare this to the quotient rule, we can see we've got a u and a v term. So we can let u equal 1. And when we differentiate that, we get 0. And we can let v equal cos x. And when we differentiate cos x, we get dv by dx would be minus sine x. Okay, so now we've got this. Um... Okay, so now we can apply this quotient rule here. So what we've got is v du dx, so cos x times 0, which would be 0, minus u dv dx, so u times minus sine x or negative sine x. So we'd have a positive sine x here. And that's all over v squared, which would be cos squared x. So what I actually have here is sine x over cos squared x. Now I can actually split this. I can write it as sine x over cos x multiplied by 1 over cos x. Now we know that sine x over cos x, well that's tan x, and 1 over cos x, well we know from the start that that is sec x. So what we have is sec x tan x. Now if you found this lesson useful, please give me a thumbs up, and in the comments below, let me know which country you're from, and what video lessons you'd like to see from me in the future.